first video they're going to be about old Joan Collins. You remember Alexis Carrington? And, you know, used to love that show. And, you know, and she had her ways with that and watching that show, etc. But, um, you know, on the personal side, uh, you know, we don't get into all that. But she talked about how she used to get down with Harry Belafonte back in the day. But, you know, she's one of those kind of chicks that, uh, rendezvous didn't mean that she was necessarily enlightened. She just had fun. And I bring her up now because apparently she had a tweet out that got since got deleted that she was talking about Hollywood, not about woke. <laughs> She's 90 years old, so this old senile bag hag is up here talking smack. But then when they pull her wig up, they say, well, wait a minute. This might be considered offensive. Then she decided to pull it. Now, she's from Britain and she's, you know, her whole thing and all that. But let's be realistic. She's aware of what she says. She ain't stupid. She ain't dumb. You know, the thing about it is this, and why I mention her is this. Don't get caught up in these celebrities and all these people. Enjoy their talents. Be a fan. Appreciate their skills, if you, you know, in, in a way. However, don't get caught up that they somehow are liberal or they open-minded or they don't have this or that. Because I found out she supports this UKIP or something, some right-wing conspiracy group over in Britain. She's funded that garbage. And she's down with all Republican parties and Trump and all that, and all that stuff. So basically, she'd be one of the people you'd see out there wearing a mega cap. I know. You don't think, you think, oh, Miss Hotty Totty, oh, proper accent, oh, that she wouldn't be. They're not. People don't be as open as you think, okay? But this is not a shock or a surprise, though. I mean, she came up with the old Hollywood system. So it's not that she would definitely be, you know, but what she would be, you know? So what do you kind of expect? But it's just the fact that they, they called her out on it and that tweet got deleted. So I always say you should stand by your truth. If that's how you feel, you should say you're not about woke. Because we know that woke... Is a code word for the N-word. We already know. That's why DeSantis uses it. And I'm sure if she goes to one of his old stiff neck parties, they'd say it. That's real fashionable. See, when white folks get a certain level of mainstream or what have you, they use code words. Back in the day, they didn't have to use a code word. They just tell you what they called you. But political correctness and also because you might get a two-piece sandwich if you said the wrong word, but it still means the same thing. It's just done in a scripted, low-key, fashionable way. But we know where she's going with that. So that's how she feels. Just so you know, Joan Collins is a racist piece of trash. And she put it out there and then she turns around and did a flip. No one's going to hold it against her unless they want truth. But no one really wants truth in this country. So you see it all the time. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome with all the comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. Share the video if you want to. And I'm out.